kiss for you. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Welcome to my second part of the video series on phone contacts app using Android Studio. All right, guys. So I will continue from where I had left. So here we are going to uh, use or use the adapter and set it to the cycler view. Sorry, not use, but we will initialize the adapter so here we need to create a new java package and we can name it as adapters and here we can create a new java class and name it as my adapter and it will extend with recycler view dot adapter and here we can say my adapter dot my adapter view holder and so first of all we will create the class my adapter view holder and we will extend it with the circular view dot view holder and here we will generate the constructor and now here we will also generate or implement all the method so we can click on implement method then we can create the constructor so we can say public my adapter and here we can say context this then we can say array list of type my context and here we can okay so here we first of all need to initialize it globally so we can say context and we can say a list of type my context then we can say this dot context equal to context and this dot my contact array list equal to this dot my context array list equal to my array list all right then here inside our own create view holder class so we can say view equal to layout inflator dot from and here i can pass context then we can say dot inflate our uh, dot layout dot item list and then we can pass the parent and then the false and finally we can say return new my adapter view holder and here we can pass the view object and here we can create the layout resource file and after that inside our get item count method so we can say my context dot size and okay so now here we can create this or edit the resource file so here first of all we will use the linear layout then we can use the it as wrap content then i can use the card view and it will be match parent and also it will be wrap content and let's set the margin to 2 dp then inside this card view we have the relative layout and we have match parent wrap content and we can say orientation okay so we don't need the orientation and here we can set the padding to 10 dp and inside this relative layout we have the app compact text view and here it will be match parent 
and the height will be wrap content and here we can say to left off and here I can pass IB message and we can say to right off IB call sorry to start off and I can say IB message and let's set the text to Haroon then we can change the text color and it will be color primary color primary dark and we can change the text size to 16 deep SP then we can have another app compact text view and it will be match parent wrap content then we set it below okay so I think I should have it the ID as text name then we can say ID text name and then we can say to left of IB message and we can say to start of IB message and I will define this IB message now but before that we can set the text to zero and any specific any number then we can say text color to color primary and we set the text size to 14 sp then now we need to have the image button so we can say app compact image button and it will be wrap content wrap content then we can say align parent and to true and we can say align top and it will be IB message and we need to set the background so for the background and here we can have the image asset and here we can say message and let's name it as message then we can have the call so we can create another drivable and we name it as for call all right and here we can have the source drivable call and after that we can have an okay so here let's set the id ib call and let's now create another image button and let's set it to wrap content wrap content margin right and dp to left of IB call to start off IB call 
and we can set the background okay so here we don't need the source but we can set the background okay so here also we can have the background and we can say drawable message and let's set the id to ib message okay so i think it is now enough and now we need to have the text view here some um, initialize the control so here we can say text view and we name it as tv name then we have tv number so for that we can have tv name equal to text view item view dot find view by id r dot id dot text name then we have tv number equal to item view dot find view by id and we can say okay i think i did not set the id so here we can have the id as text number so i will just copy that and paste it here then we have the image buttons app compact image button call button and the message button So here we can have the images button as call button equal to item view dot find view by id and we can say r dot id dot ib call then we have the message button equal to item view dot find view view by id r dot id dot ib message okay guys so i think that is enough for no now i will create the last part of the series in my next part of this series so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe